Hi everybody, we've got a new feature to show you today. If you are not an agency owner, I would skip this video. This is only for agency owners. So agency owners, we've made it a lot easier for you to manage your workspaces and we've made it just a lot more clear for you um, where you are within the software and where you make changes to your clients' workspaces. And we've even given a little bit more power to each of your clients to make changes and really make the software their own, especially for the resale clients that you have. So I'm gonna show you that as well. Let's jump right in. First of all, let's start with the top navigation. No matter which workspace that you're switched to, it's always going to show your agency owner information up here to make it clear who's logged into the system. Before it was a little strange that it would show the um, client information up here as you switch through the different workspaces. So now that's no longer going to be the case. Another thing we've done is before when you were logged into a different workspace, like a client workspace, you'd have to go to the top right and there was something called workspace settings. Um, you don't need to do that. You, don't, you only need to jump into a workspace for a client when you're ready to actually service that client. Now all of the account details, the account information, billing, all of that is consolidated here. So what you have now, um, let's say Taco Bell, for example, if you jump into settings for this, now we've got a slide in where you can control everything about this uh, workspace. You can change their plan, change the credit card info, um, apply uh, discount codes, things like that. Even change the logo for that particular workspace. Now look at how that changes when we jump into a charge for access client. So look at how Acme Realty since I'm an agency CRM user, Acme Realty signed up using their credit card and using our Stripe integration. So notice how it changes for them. We've added a new level of control for agency CRM owners where you can jump right in here and notice how before it had information about the plan that they had. Now what it has is the plan that they selected and that they purchased. So let's say they call you up and say, okay, I bought the senior social media manager plan but I want to switch down to the social media manager plan. Now as the agency owner, you can go in here and change that. Now from now on, they'll only be billed at this level. And this credit card information, you can actually update their credit card information if they don't want to do it themselves within the billing tab that we give them as well. So they still have the power to do this themselves, but now you guys have a little more control over that. As we go up to the top here, you now have something a little bit different. You have an agency settings. So before it was just workspace settings. Now um, for your agency, you're always going to appear at the top and things are just a little bit different. Now you've got agency logo that you can change, agency name. So this is where you're going to make all of the changes for the settings for your particular agency, including the credit card you're paying with. Uh, for your agency CRM payments um, and any upgrades that you have. So notice that any changes you make are also gonna be instantly made automatically, but you can click save if you'd like. Now what I wanna do is jump into the client experience. So I'm gonna jump into Ferrari's um, workspace settings. Um, before there was a little bit of an issue that we fixed, so before, if you were a client, you didn't have access to workspace settings, which you still don't. But what that meant was some of the controls within workspace settings were really more personal. It's like localization features and they weren't able to set it themselves, but now they can. So you're probably familiar with this. This is the workspace preferences that they have access to. We added a section called company settings. So now your client can go in and set their own time zone, their own date format, um, time format, and when to start the calendars. So this is very empowering for them where they can set this at the company and account level. Of course, they can still do it at the user's level and they're still able to you know, create sub-users and create localization at that level as well. But this just gives them a little bit more control over the um, settings. And this is especially important for those resell agency CRM clients we have who are actually selling licenses. You want your clients to be able to run their own software and set the own, their own settings without having to reach out to you. So this just gives them a little more control 
over their own accounts. I hope this helps you guys in the long run. Initially, this is going to be a learning curve, um, but I think you're going to enjoy it. I've been using this for weeks now as we kind of work out the kinks um, on our test server, and I'm so happy it's live so you guys can enjoy it too. Please reach out to us and chat if you have any questions about these new changes. Thanks a lot.